How is everybody doing today? Good morning. Good morning. Give me some shout outs in the chat. Let me know how you're doing. How you feeling? How you feeling? Good morning. Good morning, Daniela. Daniela. If I may probably not exactly pronounce it right, but I will eventually get it right. Morning, Amisha. I have to look in just a minute. Sue gave me some shout outs. The attendance quiz is not ready. I'll post that a little bit later. So just be on the lookout. Hey, is it Navian? Navin? Navin? How do you say how do you say that? Navin. 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 Okay, I would try to get it right. I'll probably say it Navin. 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 I like that. Hey, Makaya, how are you? Um I will get the attendance quiz ready. It'll probably be after class sometime. So everybody on here, are you signed up for Remind? I will put it out on Remind to let you know to go do the attendance quiz. So let's make sure that we get that done. Who's your brother, uh, Makaya? Who, who? Tell him I say hey, though. Hey, Armani. RJ, Lord, you know, I was just talking about RJ the other day uh, to uh, Miss Weeks. I thought uh, RJ didn't move to Charlotte. Good morning, Addison. Let's move to Charlotte. Concord, is, is that where he's at? He's in Concord. He's still there. Does he like it? Tell him we miss him. But tell him he can come on back up this way then. All right, all right. So, guys, if you don't know, some of you, if you have not been here, um, all right. Look, now tell me. With a show of hands, uh, if if this is your first day of class, raise your hand. If this is your first day of class, raise your hand. Okay, Jonathan, Amisha, Navin. Okay, so this is your uh, first day of class. All right, what we normally do is when you come on, you'll go to Canvas, go to quizzes, and take the attendance quiz. I have not, I do not have the attendance quiz up yet. It probably won't be until a bit later. Um, so what you do every day when you come to class, I'll give y'all a few minutes to go do the attendance quiz. Again, you go to Canvas under quizzes, and it'll say, uh, attendance quiz and whatever date we are. So the one for the day, when I put it up. Oh, you didn't raise you. I'm sorry. Adriana. It was for Adriana. Thank you, Misha. But Adriana, you know where to go because you've taken my class before. You go to quizzes and um, it'll say attendance quiz. Today it'll say attendance quiz 1721. That's what it'll say Monday through Thursday, whatever date we are. Then on Fridays, we are not required to come to class but you still have to take the attendance quiz. So on Fridays, you still go to Canvas, you go to quizzes, it'll say attendance Friday, and tomorrow it'll say attendance Friday 1A. Now, when I go, I'm going back to when I said Friday classes are not, you don't have to attend. Let me put it to you this way. So what happens is if you don't do your assignments like you need to do, if you're not turning them in, if you're missing too many days, you will have Friday school. It won't be an option. It will be a requirement. I'm also going to set aside days. I have. I used to do Monday through Thursday. You can come make up attendance, work, but I'm going to change my schedule. So I will post my schedule soon, um, put it in remind, and let you know when uh, my days will be. Do not, from this day forward, I don't want you missing class. 
Every now and then I know somebody might get sick or things happen. But I don't want you to miss a class if you don't have to miss class. Because if you... So I don't want you missing class if you don't have to miss class because then I will call you in for Friday school. Right. Ty, you're not on um on the regular um email on your regular school thing. Nah, I think they're wrong with that account. Okay. All right. I let you in because I know you and I recognize the name. Okay. Yeah. All right. So um if you guys like I said, if you don't do what you need to do, okay, you can't hear me that well. I know in that probably at the crazy, it's getting ready for the storm. If you don't, if you don't do what you need to do, then you will be coming Friday, Friday class. There may be times when I decide we need to have a Friday class. If I call it Friday class and you guys come on, I'll give you a special reward for coming on the Friday class. Okay. So again. If you don't do what you need to do, you will be coming to Friday class. If I call for a Friday class, then it'll be a special reward for you, and you'll want to show up. Got me? All right. Also, if you know that you're not going to be here on a day, just email me the night before, that morning of, that evening of, after you may say, I wasn't able to come to class, whatever, so I can count, count you in um, for being in attendance. The attendance quizzes are not an option. If you don't do those, you will get a zero at the end of the week. So all you, you need to do all attendance quizzes every day. Okay? I want you to show up to class every day. Okay? I need you to check announcements in, in uh, Canvas. Check announcements. I have a welcome letter in there. I also have... Um, the link to sign up for Remind. If you have not signed up for Remind, you need to go uh, to announcements, get that link, and sign up for Remind. Check your announcements every day. Check your email every day. You may not get uh, uh, anything, but check it every day. Um, with, I also, so I send stuff uh, through announcements. I send it through email, and I send it through Remind. You know that you can contact me just about any time. So if you have any issues, please uh, let me know. I am here for you. If you have not seen um, the, uh, the syllabus, I posted the syllabus. I went over the vision and mission statement a couple of days ago. But basically about what my requirements are when you come to class, I want you to come use. No, I, did, I haven't done it yet. Amisha, I probably won't post it to about. 12 or something. I mean, Sean, you signed up with, you signed up with Remind, right? I'll, I'll let y'all know on Remind when I post it. Um, so if, um, just make sure that uh, with class that you um, have your uh, sound on mute. Um, you can keep your cameras off unless I say that we're having a test and I want your cameras on. I don't want any, I don't want any lips. Okay, no telling about the camera. Don't worry about cameras now. We'll do it later. Um, so if I find that if we have a test or something, uh, we're doing presentations, which we're going to do today, and I ask you to turn on your cameras, you already know. Turn on your cameras. I do not require that all the time, but there will be special occasions that you will have to turn on your cameras. And, we, and guys, we are a business class. So when you go out into the business world and become your own CEO, and the business executive, you have Zoom meetings. There are going to be times when you have to turn on your cameras. So make sure that you look appropriate. You can change your background. You know, yesterday, last couple of days, I was in my trailer outside chilling. Now I'm in the office setting. So Google Meets lets you change your background. Um, we have a meet and greet. Um, also go to Canvas under modules. I'm going to show you one more time. Let me go to that. I'm going to show y'all something. Just hold on. And then we're going to go into and do and I greet, uh, meet and greet uh, presentations that you guys are supposed to have ready today. If you have not, if you don't have it ready, uh, we will talk about that in just a minute. But I want some people to present today.
give me just a moment because I want to show you to go over a couple of things with you. And a lot of you have already heard it, and that's okay. But we're going to do it again. All right. All right, so what I want to show you. Hey. All right, so what I want to show you guys is. I thought I had to put it. Okay. So, you know, every day, if you happen to miss class, you'll go to modules. And under important links are the class videos. I date them every day. So you can go on there, look at the videos, see what's going on. Also, any assignments, more than likely, I will put them under modules. You have your meet and greet. Your meet and greet is the PowerPoint presentation that most of you will be presenting today. Um, if you just joined the class for the first day, go on there. Um, this is a one to three slide PowerPoint presentation. It tells you what you need to include. Um, also, check announcements for daily announcements and to sign up for Remind. I put the link there. Quizzes is where you'll go to complete your attendance quizzes, okay? All right. So, um, who, um, I know a lot of you have just joined for today, and I'm so glad to have you. So, of course, you do not have your meet and greet presentations ready. But for those of you who have been here since day one, um, you should be ready to present. So your meet and greet is um, just a way of me and your team members getting to know you. And at this particular time, I did ask that you turn on your cameras just to introduce yourself. And then you can go back off of camera and present your screen. So I'm going to break the ice. I'm going to be, I would like, if that's okay with you, uh, to be the first to present. I have a very simple slide. I didn't want to go too far out there, but I have a very simple slide that I would like to share with you, if I can find it. And I may have to come back to it. For some reason, you know how it is when you have something and then they don't want to show up. Let me see if I can get it on now. I might not get to present mine today. Sometimes it won't act like that. Then sometimes, guys, y'all know we're all in this together. I don't, uh, it's operator error is what I call it. I will come back to mine in a minute because I can't get mine to show. Who would like to go and present today? Who wants to do their meet and greet um, today? Who can I get the volunteer first to do their meet and greet? Um, let me see. Addison, would you like to do your meet and greet um, first? Sure. All right. Thank you. And Aston, if you just come on just briefly, just to, so we can see your face and announce yourself. And then, as I said, you can go back off and do your presentation. Do you want to turn my camera and just say my name? Yes. I mean, you can just turn your camera on, just say, hey, I'm Addison. With and then, like I said, you can go back off. Okay. Hi, I'm Addison. <laughs> hey, Addison, how are you doing today? Good. Okay. All right. And if you like to say, you, you can stay on or you can go back off. I'm going to mute myself so there won't be an echo.
acid is, is it going to let you present? I'm trying. Okay, all right. I just no problem. I just want to make sure things is going okay. You're fine. And ask them if you want me to come back to you, um, I can come back to you in just a few minutes. Because I know how technology is. We all know how technology is. It doesn't work when it, when we need it to work. So you want me to come back? It. It's working now. Okay. All right. Okay. So I just read it, right? Or yes, yes, just read it. And if you want to make it bigger, see if you can make the presentation bigger. And yeah, you just read your information. Okay. Did that help? It's about the same, but I think everybody can see it because I can see it. Okay. So my academic goals are to try to learn new things like as long like during during like my classes, like something that I don't know, I like to learn something else. Um, a personal goal of mine is to be more productive. Um, and I wake up kind of late during the day, so I want to wake up early so I can get stuff done during the day. And my affirmation is, is that I'm enough. Well, I chose that because <laughs> I need to hear it every day. Um, you already know my name. I'm a ninth grader. And a fun fact about me is like, I like to be outside like all the time. And that's it. Thank you, Aston. I think you did a great job. And I think you probably like a lot of us, you came out of your comfort zone. And I like your affirmation. Um, you said, I am enough. Yes, you are enough. And I uh, want to commemorate you. You said that you're going to start getting up early. I know that is a challenge for all of us, but yes, get up early so you can um, be in the right uh, frame of mind to learn new things every day. You're going to do great, Addison, and thank you so much. All right, Amisha, can I get you to go next? Sure. Hello, my name's Amisha. Mm -hmm. Um, my academic goal is to pass ninth grade with straight A's, which I've been doing good so far. My personal goal is to decorate my room because it's plain and dry. My affirmation is that I'm swag, and my fun fact is that I have a pet bunny, and I'm 15 in ninth grade. Yep. <laughs> All right, Misha. Now, Misha, tell me what what was your academic goal again? Um, to have passing straight A's for ninth grade. Okay. 
So you, your uh, academic goal, which you will achieve, is that you're going to make straight A's. And yes, you are going to do it. I thank you for coming out of your comfort zone. And glad we got to put a name with a face or a face with a name. So thank you so much. And guys, yeah. remember, if you can, to make your presentations bigger so we can see it. But I think you did an awesome job. And uh, guys, uh, we're going to do some great things here in, in our class. Thank you, Amisha. Uh, Armani, are you ready to present today? I'm not sure if you knew about the meet and greet. I'll come back to Armani. Uh, Brooke, um, can you go ahead and present today? Yeah. I was about to ask if I can go anyway. Thank you, Brooke. Um, my name is Brooke. I'm in the 10th grade. And... Wait, so we just press present, right? Yes, you can present your screen, yes. And then what you do, you read your presentation. Can you see it? Not yet. It has not popped up. It's not letting me. Okay, I'm going to let you work on it, and then you can come back and see. Sometimes I think uh, um, things are working kind of crazy with the Internet today. So just let me know in the chat when you're ready, um, you think it's, that it's going to work, okay? Okay. And if all this fails, we can do it Monday, okay? Okay. All right, thank you. Charles, are you ready to present today? Daniela, are you ready to present today? No, I wasn't here yesterday, so I didn't know about it. Okay, I heard no, but your volume is very, very low. I said I wasn't here yesterday, and I didn't know about it. Okay, okay, uh, put it in the chat for me, okay? But I think you said you're not ready to present today. Okay, so put it in the chat for me, okay? What you were saying. Um, Dinesia, Dinesia, are you ready to present today? No. All right. So you guys know, um, listen, I want you, when I give you assignments and everything, I want y'all to be ready on the day that I give you. We were going to present on Monday if we did not have enough time, but I will allow you this time to present on Monday. But here, from this point on, when I give you assignment, please be ready. Okay. Thank you. Um, who else would like to present today? We have a uh, we have a special guest. Um, we have Miss Harvey. Uh, we want to welcome Miss Harvey. Miss Harvey, do you uh, would you like to say anything, or would you uh, you're welcome to have the floor? And she may be she may be on a call, so we can come back to her. Uh, Makaya, are you ready to present? Makaya, what did you say? Oh, okay. Uh, Marvin, are you ready? Oh, Makaya, it's okay. Don't be nervous. Do you have your uh, presentation ready? Okay, will you be ready on Monday? Marvin, are you ready? Rigo, are you ready? Rigo, are you ready? Okay, your mic doesn't work, but do you have your presentation? If you have your presentation, if you want to uh, uh, go ahead and present it, and then I can read it for you if you like. Yeah. 
Do you want to do that, uh, Rigo? Okay, okay. Sincere, are you ready? Oh, when you present, you press the window or tab. Press uh, window. Press window and see what happens, uh, Brooke. Do you see it, Brooke, when you press uh, window? Okay, Victoria. Uh, go ahead, Victoria. Yes, Victoria, go ahead and do it. You're going to do a great job. Um, hello, I'm Victoria. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll present right now. All right, so we've already uh, met Victoria, and Victoria is going to share a screen uh, in just a moment. Can you see it or no? Because I, I see that it says you're presenting, but the picture has a pop, but I do see that part. Now it's coming up. And make it bigger if you can. Um, so we can see it. It should be a sh uh, present screen, maybe. Yeah, um, uh, it says you're presenting, but I'm trying to learn how to get it on my presentation. Okay, so when you, you're you presenting, um, did it give you the option? Because it, it just popped up. You hit um, window. These... Yeah. Okay, Amisha said just press your Google slide tab. She'll be back on in just a moment. I told y'all technology acting crazy day is getting ready for the snow. Let me see if I can get mine's why Victoria. Mine doesn't want to come up as well. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and share while we're waiting on the others, because I know, like I said, technology, it's crazy. Uh oh See how my eyes went off? We'll go back again. And that's not the right one. Hold on, guys. Okay. So, again, my name is Miss Hargrave. My affirmation is love every day. Personal goal, I want to read one book a week. A fun fact about me, I seem to make people laugh with the crazy things I say. 
So probably in this class, you guys would do a lot of laughing because somehow I just come off, I say some of the craziest things, and that's okay if I can make people laugh. I don't have an academic goal at this moment, but I will have one soon because I know that I will be going uh, back to school. So uh, academic goal is, you know, I always want to learn. I, I never want to stop educating myself. So again, my affirmation is love every day. Um, Victoria, uh, are you ready? Uh, Amisha's putting some, um, press present now, then press A tab, then press the Google slide tab where it has your presentation for anyone who doesn't know how to present. Okay, Victoria, you wanna go ahead and try your uh, presentation? Okay, hit your present button up at the top beside of share and then make it bigger. Um, Victoria, if you will, send the presentation to me, share it with me, and maybe I can share it from my screen. Uh, okay, that's fine right there. I think you're back in see it. Okay, you can go ahead and read it if you want to. All right. Um, my academic goal this year is to keep staying on top of my work, even when it's close to the year, because I tend to like procrastinate a lot more. And what me is I play volleyball now. Oh, and did you know? Okay, you were kind of going in and out right there, but I see that 
you play volleyball. You currently play volleyball now? Oh. Might have to put it in the chat. Okay. Uh, now, volleyball, you say you're playing volleyball now? You may have to put it in the chat because I think something is going wrong with the volume. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you're playing volleyball now, which is awesome. So you are a freshman. I play volleyball now, and when when I was hmm, I don't know what's wrong with it, it's, you're I coming played, in and out. I mean, He's I strong, and then you're kind of fighting. Okay, okay, all right, cool. So uh, I, I noticed that you say um, your affirmation is today is going to be an awesome day. Can you hear me? So you make sure that you recite the affirmation every day. Yes, I can hear you, yes. So you make sure that you recite the affirmation every day. Yes. Um, and also about waking up, yes. Um, that Waking up, yes, try to wake up early. So I think that you're going to do uh, great. What I want you to do is maybe on Monday, I want you to present again. Although we can see it, but I think we um, we need to be able to hear it for it to be really effective. But I think yeah, you man. did a great job with your meeting. Okay. But you did a good job and I got you, but I want you to do it so uh, we will be able to uh, hear you better. And it's okay. Don't, Victoria, you don't have to be sorry about anything. That's just technology. We're all in it together. So you are fine, okay? I appreciate you doing your presentation. So you're good. Is there anybody else that would like to do their presentation? Ty, are you ready? Okay, okay. Thank you. Ty, are you ready to do your presentation? Sincere? Okay, okay, so Brooke, you sent your presentation. Okay, thank you. Guys, I just don't want y'all to come on and then, you know, I just get the screen because I do notate that, you know, I'm just getting the screen and, and I put an S up there and it's not for a Superman or Superwoman. Remember, I have told you that, okay? I am going to pull up Brooke's presentation. She sent it to me, so hopefully we'll get to share it. So um, this is my presentation. Okay. So, so you can see the presentation. Let me just yeah, share the tab right now. Can you still see it? No, it's like no, 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 Okay. All right, Brooke. Can you um the next slide? So an, an academic goal that I have th for this year, I would want to keep up on my assignments and stop procrastinating when it comes to my assignments and do not get behind on my work like last semester. A personal goal I have for myself is to become a nail tech. I have been practicing and hoping to graduate and go to nail school and become certified so I can start my nail career. An affirmation my affirmation is that I am the architect of my life and I build its foundation and choose its contents. 
And a fun fact about me is that I have flown solo twice to Florida and Texas. All right, so I like that. So, Brooke, you are an aspiring um, nail tech, right? Yes, I've been practicing for about six months. Okay, when you say practicing, how do you practice? So, when I first started, like, I bought a whole bunch of stuff, like acrylic powders, and I practiced on my sister's hands, and I got um, some practice fingers and a practice hand to practice on. Okay. And I've also done other people's nails. Okay. So show me some of your work. Um, I am a nail tech and will always be a nail tech. I had a nail salon in Lexington for a couple of years. I may reopen one. Uh, I've been thinking about it. Uh, my thing is I like doing natural nails. Uh, that was always my, I like doing natural nails. Um, I'm not big on doing acrylic. I, I like gel nails. But um, manicures, not manicures, pedicures are my thing. Yeah. I do different types of pedicures. I do a chocolate pedicure. So I do different types. So it can be done. Um, now, I know there. you probably can start um, taking classes now. And I'm going to have to try to look into it, too. Um, you can do them virtually. But when uh, when I did mine, I had to go to school at night. Um and uh, then I took my uh, class, I took my test, uh, my state board test at Davidson County Community College. And I had to bring a, uh, someone to be my model. And they're probably doing everything online now. So I'm going to call mm -hmm. the state board again to see. I think they're probably doing, I'm pretty sure, I know they're doing the classes. The classes you should be able to do online, but you can still go in person for some of them. So I may go back in person uh, because, like I said, I used to do nails, but I haven't done them in a while, so I want to go back and refresh myself. But yeah, yeah keep practicing. Keep practicing, and you can look at videos. Look at videos and stuff. Yeah, I do and, I, yeah and what you want to do is one of the big things, I always make sure that you sanitize, okay? Yeah, like that, especially yeah. with other people. Huh? I said especially with other people. Yeah, and the the utils, the utensils, the tools that you use, when you use them on a person, if they are made out of, you know, what you know, you can sanitize those. Uh, you used to go and buy what it's called, it still can, barbicide. Yeah, I got that. Yeah, make sure that you clean your tools with a certain amount of time. And, you know, you separate those, the, the dirty uh, tools from the clean tools. So you put them in a box. They have to be in a container and make sure that you label them because that's what you want to get in the habit of. Because when you go to do your state board, you have to have a uh, container that's labeled uh, dirty. And you have to have a container that's labeled uh, clean. And so all of that, make sure that you do that now. Okay. Okay, and you know, I can give you points, but like I said, yeah, I used to have a nail salon. So you're the second one, second student, my other student in another class wants to become a nail tech. Like I said, it is a it's a lucrative business, I mean you can make a lot of money. Then sometimes people will compare you because they'll say, Well, I can go down the street and get ten dollars cheaper. Well, you go ahead down the street then. Because right. you know, I don't I, I, I didn't do cheap nails. So my products were expensive, so I, I charge for what I paid in my services. Yeah. So uh, keep doing what you're doing. Don't let anybody stop you. Yes, you've got to get up early sometimes. You have to set your alarm on your phone, get up, get things done, get yourself situated for the day. I think you did a great job with your presentation. Um, and so thank you for presenting. Um, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Nevin, you said you want to present today. So, Nevin, if you uh, come on and you can go ahead and present. Hold on, I need to get off my phone to the computer. Okay.
Hello, I'm Navin. Do you see it? Yes, I can see it coming up. And if you would hit that present present button. You see it now? I can see it, but hit the present button up there by the share button uh -oh. and make it a little bit bigger. Right here? Yes. It may take a while. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Yeah, my name is Navin. I'm having you meet me. One of that goal is build a good study habit. I'm a senior. I don't really have a personal goal. A fun fact about me is that I'm lazy and I watch any toys 24-7 and I play I like playing basketball. Okay, awesome. So uh, your academic goal is to build good study habits. Okay, so ha have you started, what are you gonna, what's, how are you starting to build good study habits? Um, take notes. Okay. Yeah, that's really what I'm about. Okay, take notes. And what you do is every day when you have notes, just go over your notes. Look over your notes each evening at home. Well, you're at home anyway. So look over your notes each evening after class. Um, your um, personal goal is okay not to have a personal goal. But your personal goal may to be to um, to become organized. Um, and I like your affirmation. Is that your affirmation? I'm happy being me. Yeah. I like that. So that is awesome. So make sure that you include the affirmation uh, on your papers. Guys, uh, if you've got an affirmation, put it on a t-shirt and everybody going to want one of them t-shirts. You, uh, uh, Navin, you need to come up with, I'm happy being me. Now, um, Navin, what is anime? Is it anime? What is, is that how you say it? Anime. Anime. What is that? Um, it's Japanese. It's like a, it's like um anime um it's like a I I seen it and and there and also I think I had used to work um um part time and one of my managers was into anime and they had a anime convention. Have you yeah. ever been to one of the conventions? Yes, I have. Yeah, so I know about the, the uh, anime. It's really big, but uh and they would play the anime music all the time. And uh, yeah. so I know about that. It's it's very it's very popular. So I think that uh, after after you graduate, what do you plan to do? To see, uh, get a job, and get a car, and then find okay. a suitable place to live, and then just just stay to do what I do. Okay. Now you say you're gonna get a job. So do you? Do, would you like to go to college? Nope. Why? Too much money. No, it's not. Yes, it is. If if I could say that I could um get you in contact with some people who would pay for you to go to college, guarantee you a job, they're gonna pay for you to go to college, they're gonna guarantee you a job after you graduate. You're gonna have, only have to go to school two years, you're gonna get a job and a sign on bonus. With just they're gonna give you a job, then they're gonna give you an extra two thousand dollars. Would you do it? Man, that's too much work. Too much work? Why is it too much work? Because I'm lazy. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, Navin, we're going to work on that. But any, right. any, any seniors who are interested, it's a really good uh, program. It's a, uh, a local company that has just uh, came, probably been about two or three years. And they pay for you to go to college. You only have to go two years, and then they're going to guarantee you a job. Starting out with at least thirty six thousand a year. So, just let me know. I'm gonna uh, get y'all get some people to come in and talk to you, okay? But there's nothing wrong with working because you may want to start your own business after. So think about that, okay? <laughs> yeah, I took a class of business finance. Yeah, I mean, you may want to start your own business and stuff. I mean, uh, what else besides uh, anime and basketball do you like to do? Um, probably cooking. Okay. Hey. All right. So what kind of things are you cooking? Now, you're doing better than me because I don't cook. 
what, what <laughs> kind of things you like to cook hot dogs? Um, I don't know how to say it. It's mostly like Cambodian food. Okay. Well, you know what? One day I would like for you to, you know what you can do? Hmm. Because we are at Microsoft Word and Powerful, I would like for you to do a PowerPoint presentation showing pictures, uh, showing videos of you cooking food. And we see the end result. That's tough. I'm How is it tough? That. I'm not doing that. I cook only for me to eat, not to show the people. Oh, gosh, Nevin. Nevin, work on it, Nevin. <laughs> huh. but, all right, but thank you, Nevin, for doing your presentation. I really appreciate it. Okay. All right, Ty, do you want to do your presentation? Sincere? My my account is like locked or something. Is what? My account messed up. It won't let me get into it. You talking about your? My school account. What's it saying? It said uh, I need a security key to get into it. Okay, email. I'm going to put um, email. This is the person you need to email. Okay. We'll put it in the chat. So copy it right now. Email Mr. Hudson. Tell him what's going on because you're going to have to get into your account. Okay. Email him and see what he says. And then if I need to do anything on my end, I would definitely help you. Okay. Okay. All right. So, but look, I'm going to show, I'm going to send you, Ty, the uh, meet and greet presentation, what you got to do. Okay. It's, it's okay. very simple. Okay. I'll yeah. send you your email. You, you, you still able, are you able to get into your email or no? Yeah, on my phone, but I can't do nothing. I can't like, cause it's like hard to write on there. Let me see. Mm, if I present something, are you able to take a picture of it with your phone now? Yeah. Let me see if it'll let me. Let's see what's going on. Okay, can you take a picture of that? Uh yeah, Let and that's my... all. Only thing you gotta do it can be anywhere from a one to three slide PowerPoint. You're gonna cool. You're gonna put what your academic goal is, what your personal goal is, affirmation is anything positive. And I put um, you can uh, Google positive affirmations, or it could be like a one line, a sentence, oh. or something that you know that's positive that yeah. you like. That you it's a saying or a phrase. Make okay. sure you include your name, your classification, meaning what grade you're in. What grade you're in, Ty? You're in the 10th or 9th? I'm in 9th. You're in 9th. Okay, so put your, that you're a freshman and put a fun fact about you. Uh, I'll, and I also said if you want to include any kind of nice graphics, make sure that you have that ready for Monday, okay? Did you get a picture of it? Yeah, I took a picture of it. Okay, okay. Um, Sincere, are you available? Lindsay. Okay. Oh, yes, I'm here. Okay, so Sir, uh, do you have your presentation ready? Uh, yeah, I do. Okay, can we uh you know what, Sincere? Uh go ahead. I think we got time. We got three minutes. Uh can we see you? Can you just give us a quick so we can see your face? And then you can go and present real quick. I don't I don't think it's possible. Say it again. I don't think that's possible. You don't think that's possible? Okay. All right. Can you go ahead and present? Oh, uh, yeah. All right, guys. Y'all going to have to show me y'all faces eventually. I know y'all handsome and pretty, but come on now. Okay. So see, if you want to, just wait until Monday, okay, to present. You hear me, Sincere? Right. 
Sincere, did you hear me? Uh, are you uh if you want to um if you want to wait until Monday, sincere? Uh, a, yeah, you wait, yeah. You wait Monday? Yeah, I can wait till Monday. Okay, and will I be able to see your face for about 30 seconds on Monday? Maybe. Why you say maybe? Um because um are you yeah. shy, sincere? Oh, you can say that. Okay, but look, uh, this is your grace. I need to see your face on Monday. So, okay. Yes, ma'am. And I don't think you gotta do is show me your face if you want to put a background up. You can, but I need to see your face on Monday. So, guys, uh, I will post the attendance quiz in about ten minutes. So, go and complete the attendance quiz. Sign up for Remind if you have not signed up for Remind. Those of you who did not post today, you will post Monday, or you, I will post this on Monday, which is a zero. All right. I will see y'all guys on Monday. Have a good weekend.